morning, everybody. It's Sunday. Um, we're here for day two of this crazy meet down here at Georgia Tech. Um, I've never vlogged before, so I figured, you know, we would start we'd start talking about things that would improve performance in meets and things like that, but it's really turned into um, how poorly run this meet is. I mean, really. Y yikes. Uh, it's very bad. I mean, I don't know how to best explain it, but it's very, very slow. Um, the dive over stars, they're not doing those um, correctly. Um, I don't know why you would put a six-year-old in a hundred fly. I mean, really? Stop. And she did flip turns, bless her heart. I mean, she went totally extra and did an actual flip turn on every wall. Um, so the meat's running very, very slow. Um, I think for the tiny, tiny kids, I think Summer League is awesome. It's a great, fun experience, especially for the kids and the parents. But these you know, big meets and big notatoriums for tiny, tiny kids, um, it's hard. And it's hard for the parents. I mean, a lot of the parents were like, oh my gosh, are, are, is, this what a, is this what a swim meet's like? And I'm like, it's not, it's not supposed to be this hard. It's actually supposed to be a little more fun. But it does take a certain personality to sit through a swim meet. Um, so anyways, um, this is us driving in. Uh, we're gonna find a place to park and then we're gonna head on into the meet and see if uh, today goes any better so I don't go crazy, okay? Bye. All right, good morning, everybody. Day two of the swim meet and it's way more manageable today. Like, not as crazy as it was yesterday, see? have every age group here and um, I have my $7 lunch versus a $27 lunch. So way happier. Let's see how today goes and um, I'll check back in. And uh, whoever's doing the music here is totally from the 80s because it's like all my jams. Oh, uh, P.S. Um, that fire marshal deal, that guy is back. There's no one here, and he is on patrol. So, um, are you making announcements? Um, Coach, as far as the time is now, I will, uh, I will zoom in on this guy when I see him. He is on the ball. Takes the job very seriously. Warm ups. Ain't all for the warm ups. There's nobody here. I'm going to talk really quickly about parents coaching the kids. It's another struggle we go through is watching our kids um, and trying to help them, especially the, the parents that don't have um, any swimming experience. Um, that's tough to watch. <laughs> it's, um, um, you know, so I, I think, and, and the kids always look irritated, like you don't know what you're talking about. So my best advice there is if you do record their swim, just show it to them and say, tell me what you think and what did your coach say? And literally leave it at that. So I struggle with that too. I actually was uh, telling Rachel this morning on the right here, just one thing about the start, you know, making sure that she really does a nice streamline and really uses her kick. And, um, you know, that's hard for kids to take any type of constructive criticism um, from your parent, even if your parent's a swimmer or a former swimmer, rather. Um, you know, I had to tell her, I'm like, you have to be coachable. It's not me being mean, it's just me saying, you're going to get a lot further not swimming with a start than having to swim faster and harder to catch up after a bad one. And lo and behold, on her 100 backstroke, she did a beautiful start and dolphin kicks the whole nine yards. And she came up ahead of people and she came over to me afterwards and she was like, so that was kind of fun and gratifying for me. Um, my kid just swam the, um, just swam. Hunter free and can't warm down for the rest of the entire afternoon. And look at all the, um, like, I know it's for divers or whatever, but there's, we paid for this meet, so I don't, I don't really don't get it. 
Um, she's got two more events to go. She's got a monster run the corner that I am, and she's not getting in cold swimming. I will be sending an email with all caps very shortly to someone important. You guys, you guys, this just keeps getting better. Oh my god, I think somebody took a dump in the pool. That is why they clear the entire diving uh, well. That's so gross. Hold on. Oh my gosh, you guys see this person right here? He's gloving up to go get the dump. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Get it, you can do it! Look at her. Is that a boy or a girl? It's a girl. She's like, oh my god, what are you gonna bring up for me? Oh my gosh, you guys. I think I'm gonna throw up. I was so angry. So I was thinking, are you seriously gonna come? What does he have? What does he have? Uh, uh oh. He has a strainer. He has a strainer. <gasps> You can do it! You can do it! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, glove up, girl. Glove up. You've got to get some gloves on. Glove up. Oh, uh, Please, put gloves on. Hurry, hurry! He's got it, he has it. He's secured it. That's right, get your glove on. Get both of them on. Oh my gosh, what is it? Bring it up, oh, get the bag ready. This is what happens when you have six year olds. Hopefully, oh, oh my god, oh my gosh. <sighs> Transfer? Uh, oh my, oh! Oh! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> hey you guys, oh my gosh, I'm still here. It's 540, 540. Um, they've just started um, 10 heats of 500 free. And then there's 400 IM, which is what Rachel's swimming. Um, again, the struggles of being a swim parent, staying here all day long through the ups and downs, including the poopy pool, which was a highlight for me. <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> that made me just cry laughing. But what's even more concerning is that pool's open again. I don't know how they did that. Um, some major chlorine shock in that pool, but there are kids swimming in it right now, so I don't know what they dug out of that pool, but if it was any other pool, it'd be closed the rest of the night, and if it was our summer league pool, they would have shocked the living daylights out of it, so still here, still waiting for Rachel to swim, she's had a great meet, um, but this is, uh, this has been nuts, nutty meet, um, Hey everybody, Coach Ward here. I am done. I mean, can you tell? Done. Um, everybody's leaving. Uh, Rachel was uh, the last one warming down in the poop pool behind us, um, which I'm very proud of her uh, for knowing to warm down, even though it's a little sketchy with what happened earlier. Um, but uh, yeah, we're on our way home. Um, that's it for the vlog. I am done. Um, and by the way, I just watched. Emma Chamberlain's new video, which I'm probably the oldest person to ever watch her channel, and was disappointed. So, we will give her another go around and see if her next one's more funny, but we'll see. I mean, we'll see. I'm very picky. Anyways, you guys have a great weekend, and I'll see you next time. Bye.